begins with live team coverage of the aftermath and the recovery from that brutal storm tonight. A consumer alert for disaster victims. Resources are streaming into Iowa from all across the nation. Outreach groups and companies looking to provide their services, but some Iowans say the companies are doing more harm than good. Iowa's News Now reporter Devin Truby leads off our live team coverage with one man's shocking story. Devin. That's right, Christopher. We've seen companies from Florida, Georgia, Minnesota, all offering cleanup services. But one man in Robbins wishes they never knocked on his door. His warning to you, his fellow Iowans, about outside companies. A yard full of debris, branches hanging, trees in need of removal. Carl Knight knew he couldn't do it all safely and had two elderly parents to take care of. So when a Georgia company came knocking on his front door, he said yes. Got rid of all the safety rules, cutting stuff too long. He was warned by his supervisor not to do it, but he didn't stop. He ended up hitting damage in my garage. He ran into my power line a couple of times. They did excess damage to the yard that shouldn't have been done. Leaving him with this, trees with pieces broken off, a shed crushed by branches. And they want $9,000 from me for this mess. The company returning to Knight's property Friday, trying to make it right. I told him to leave my property and he wouldn't. He was persistent. He's going to fix this and said, you know, I don't want you guys on here by what you did and the way you're acting. Well, he goes, that's only one crew. <laughs> How do I know this? I mean, you already proved you can't be trusted. His warning to fellow Iowans saying, after all we've been through, we don't deserve this. We're Iowans. We take care of people. We care. The company treejob.com returned to Knight's property today, but Knight called the police. Now, law enforcement says they warned the company not to return to the property. The company's owner says they will not be charging Knight for the services. Live in Robbins, Devin Truby, Iowa's News Now.